Hi everyone! I am here in Milano about to go out for some meetings. I decided that I might as well show you a little makeup video. So today I'm gonna do a very kind of glowy, easy skin. I do have moisturizer on, but you can see I have really, really bad bags, unfortunately. So I'll have to try and get rid of those and get rid of these little blemishes of this shininess here add in some glow. I'll do this kind of like signature classic eyeliner look. Let me know if you want me to do a separate video with a more like a day-to-day -day, um, casting model look because I feel like I've learned so much on how to enhance your features and still look like you're wearing no makeup. Today we are gonna start with uh, brushing my lips. Yes, you didn't overhear me brushing my lips. So basically that's just a trick that I use to um, exfoliate my lips but also plumb them up. I'm nice and rosy. So I've done the lips. Oh my god that hurt. Disclaimer that is pretty uncomfortable. I first use this little stick for vanishing stick from Estee Lauder. This was part of the Kendall Jenner collection and seriously I have been using it for the past like two years and whenever it came out. This one is perfect for traveling because first of all it's a stick so I can have it on the plane as well and I'll put it in my t-zone usually a little bit under my eyes because this part here gets pretty shiny. And then you can see for instance here is really shiny right? You can see the shininess literally went away. That is done. On a day-to-day -day basis, I don't like using foundation. I'm gonna use this Laura Mercier Secret Camouflage Palette in um, SC3. It's seriously changed my life. I've had it for the past few months. And this is literally what I use every single day, um, especially because I've had this little zits here for like three months and they're not going away. So what I'll normally do, I'll use it with this really nice soft brush from Tom Ford. I'll take a little bit of this. It's very, very light coverage. If you have more problematic skin, you probably don't want to use this. Um, but it works for someone like me. What I like doing afterwards is just tapping in with my finger. You know I always love using my fingers to smudge the makeup in. Next we're gonna move to my bronzer, but I'm gonna actually use my bronzer on my eyelids. I'm gonna try this new Kiko brush. Okay, that is good. Now I'm gonna use this eyeliner. I'm gonna do quite a thick eyeliner, so be prepared. Uh, I normally prefer to start it from like halfway through, just because I have longish eyes, but they're also quite like round, so I don't wanna make them even rounder. What I wanna do really is enhance the length of the eye. So you can see the difference. Suddenly it makes my eye look much higher, kind of gives me an eye lift. This little stick here, it's from Glossier, it's called Scope, and it's a highlighter, but it's liquid and it's super neutral which is why I like using it for um, day makeups. I saw it right here. You can see straight away it gives like a nice shine, but it doesn't have a color. So because of that, it looks really nice and natural. I'll use this new highlighter that I just got, but I really loved it. It's called Glow Fusion. It's in 01, it's from Kiko, but basically it is neutral. Add it on top of the it's 
same bronzer as you saw before. Take it off. Oh wait, I forgot to do my eyebrows. Okay, I'll just fill them in a little bit now. I love this little stick from Dior. So easy to travel with. What I do with my eyebrows is normally just fill in the ends. I never touch my eyebrows in here, or almost never. Maybe just for like red carpets or when I know there's gonna be very hard photography, like hard flash and stuff. Uh, but in general, during the day, never here. And even at night, I just add like kind of like almost dots in there. Now a little trick, since I don't have a an eyebrow gel, and this hair gel, which I got yesterday because I wanted like a sleek look. So I'm gonna take a little bit of the hair gel. You can do the same with hairspray. I guess more of you will have hairspray. And you just put it, add it on this brush. That will kind of hold your eyebrows in place and make them nice and like natural, messy looking, which is what I really, really love. And again, I forgot to add mascara. I have this little one from Armani, which is like a nice travel, um, travel size. Yeah, I'll only apply my mascara uh, here at the edges because again, I want to give my eye a nice little lift and I want to make it looking wider and more elongated that is it I am ready for the day and I hope you guys enjoyed this um, I hope it was useful it's very simple makeup but you know I don't do like heavy makeups at least um, not if it's just day-to-day -day wear um, so I do hope this was useful and I hope you enjoyed it Thank you for watching, love you, and see you soon. Make sure you stay around because I'm gonna do a lot of vlogs and a lot of like travel vlogs and work vlogs and stuff like that. So make sure you subscribe and like this video, please. Only if you liked it, if you really, really liked it. If you really, really liked it, do some thumbs up. Love you.